hey guys, one of the things that you have to learn are your accurate values for some of the trigonometry functions. Um, so I've made you some little flashcards here. Not too many because there aren't too many to learn, but it is really, really worth you learning these. So you can either watch this video over and over and over and over and over again until you have them all sorted. Use this video to make your own flashcards or pop over to my website and get the flashcards that I've already made for you if you want to save a bit of time. But these ones aren't too tricky, but it's really, really worth learning them since I think I'm right in saying this, every single non-calculated paper I've had the chance to look at has had a question about this. Just like a one mark multiple choice question, but if you're aiming for those top grades, we need to get all the one mark multiple choice questions correct. What is the value for sine one? One. What is the value for cos 60? half. What is the value for tan 45? 1. What is the value for cos 30? That is the square root of 3 over 2. What is the value for cos 45? That is 1 over the square root of 2. What is the value for tan 0? That is 0. What is the value for tan 60? That is the square root of 3. What is the value for cos 0? That's 1. What is the value for sine 60? That is square root of 3 over 2. What is the value for sine 0? 0. What is the value for sine 30? That's a half. What is the value for sine 45? 1 over the square root of 2. What is the value for cos 1? 0. What is the value for tan 30? 1 over the square root of 3. What is the value for sine 1? 1. What is the value for cos 60? Half. What is the value for tan 45? 1. What is the value for cos 30? Square root of 3 over 2. What is the value for cos 45? 1 over the square root of 2. What is the value for tan 0? Zero? 0. What is the value for tan 60? Square root 3. What is the value for cos 0? That's 1. What is the value for sine 60? Square root 3 over 2. Okay, I have no idea how many times we went through those, but it is worth going through them as many times as you possibly can. Now, a potential nasty, nasty question they could ask you um, on an uncalculated paper is actually working these out, okay? It is possible, it's not, it's not too nasty, uh, but it's something you're unlikely to have necessarily been taught or think is that important because you might need just ask to remember them. Um, it's not too nasty, but that is something that they could possibly ask. So, learn these, uh, make your own flashcards, or pop over to my website and get these ones. 